astronomy fans are counting down the days to the total solar eclipse. It'll cross over North America next Monday. A physics and an astronomy professor at Clemson University says safety should be the top priority of everyone planning to view the eclipse. He also offers some creative solutions to protect yourself during the eclipse. You go in your kitchen, grab a colander, uh, but uh, if you go to NASA's website, you can figure out how to build, build what's called a pinhole projection camera, which will allow you to cast the sun's image and the eclipse onto a viewing screen or even onto the ground. Ah, NASA says for most Americans, the eclipse will last about three and a half to four minutes. So you have a small window of time there to watch it. Meanwhile, some new technology now allows people to experience the eclipse without actually seeing it. Astronomers say it's part of the Light Sound Project. The goal is to create a device that turns light from the sky into sound for people who are blind or visually impaired. The new technology is meant to allow everyone to experience the eclipse. In 2017, I just distinctly remember feeling really left out. Um, I actually have this memory of feeling a little bit resentful <laughs> that I couldn't be a part of this eclipse in some way. It's going to be inclusive and having any technology that makes it possible for us to have an experience, an actual experience rather than somebody simply describing it to us is always fantastic. These light sound devices will be made available at public gatherings this year in cities where the eclipse will be visible.